your goal is to catch more fish, understanding the world below makes a world of difference. See what's beneath your boat in picture-like detail with down imaging from Humminbird. As you explore the water, you'll find structure, vegetation, bait fish, schools of fish, and even individual fish beneath your path. And using a Humminbird fish finder equipped with Mega Down Imaging Plus, you'll be able to see even the slightest details down to a fish's head, tail, and dorsal fin, thanks to a 20% improvement in clarity. Like Humminbird side imaging, Humminbird down imaging uses a razor-thin high-frequency beam. But unlike side imaging, down imaging returns are displayed vertically, similar to 2D sonar, with the most recent information appearing on the right side of the screen. Down imaging can be used in fresh or salt water for depths as shallow as 2 feet and as deep as 400 feet for the 455 kilohertz beam, or 200 feet with the Mega Down Imaging Plus beam. For help reading down imaging, remember that the strength of the sonar return determines the shade of the image. For example, softer objects or bottom terrain produce weaker returns and darker shades. Harder bottom terrain or objects generate stronger returns and lighter shades. The incredible clarity of mega down imaging can even show you individual fish. Bait fish will show up as a tight cluster of returns, while game fish will appear as solid marks. Telling the difference between bait and game, and even between different species, will allow you to target only the fish you're after. By giving you a picture-like view of what's below your boat, down imaging from Humminbird helps you spend less time guessing and more time catching. Hi, I'm John Luther, Senior Product Manager here at Humminbird. Today, I'd like to introduce you to our new Helix 7 SIGPS Side Imaging and GPS Combination Unit. One of the first things I'd like to point out about the Helix 7 series is the brightness of the screen. This unit has a 7-inch, high-definition, industry-leading LED backlit display with 480 by 800 pixel resolution. The Helix 7 GPS-capable units have a single micro SD card slot here, tucked away behind the waterproof door, conveniently located on the side. The Helix 7 is compatible with Humminbird cartography such as LakeMaster and also with optional Navionics Gold, Silver, and Hot Maps, all available now at your favorite retailer on microSD cards. On the back of the unit, you'll notice here it has three familiar friction fit connection ports. First is a power port connected to a 12 volt battery source. Next is the port where you connect your optional NMEA0183 interface cable for connecting the GPS output to optional accessories, such as a DSC radio. And finally, a port to connect your dual frequency transducer and side imaging or down imaging transducer on imaging capable models. This unit features two available mounting systems. The first is a standard gimbal mount, which is included in the box and consists of a gimbal bracket and two gimbal knobs. An optional accessory kit, the IDMK H7, uses an adhesive gasket, which allows you to flush mount the helix in the console of your boat. The unit is easily controlled by the four direction keypad and eight button keyboard. Counterclockwise from the top, you have your view key, zoom in, zoom out key, enter or check mark key, mark, go to and man overboard, and finally, your menu and your exit keys. The Humminbird Helix 7 is an incredibly easy to use unit with an intuitive and easy to navigate menu system and boasts a powerful, proven fish finding sonar. Hey guys, Jacob Scott, Lowrance product expert. Today, I wanna to talk to you about the new Lowrance Hook 2 unit. Now this is an awesome unit and it's a great product. It's an entry level price, it's feature packed, and it's really amazing to use. It has a lot of different options available to cover any price range in your budget. We've got everything from a sonar only model to a plotter only model, and then we go all the way up to our chart plotter model, which as you can see here, has the mapping option built into the unit. We have three different options in the transducer market on this. We have our bullet transducer, which is just 2D sonar. We have the split shot transducer, which gives you 2D sonar and downscan imaging. And then if you want it all, you can get the triple shot transducer that has 2D sonar, downscan imaging, and side scan imaging built into it. The next thing we did is we made this thing incredibly easy to install. If you go with the bullet transducer, it's got the flat surface that allows you to mount it to a trolling motor. It also comes with the brackets that allows you to mount it to the transom. If you choose the split shot transducer, it again also has that flat surface mount that allows you to put it on a trolling motor. 
or it comes with the transom bracket so that you can put it back on the transom. The other thing you can do with these two transducers is if you want to, you can glass them into the hole of your boat so that you're shooting through the hole. And then finally, like we talked about, our third transducer option on this unit is the triple shot transducer. It gives you the 2D sonar, it gives you the down scan imaging, and it gives you the side scan imaging. It's designed to mount on the transom of the boat or on a jack plate or one of the areas back there like that. With these transducers, we offer double the coverage of your traditional 200 kilohertz sonar. The screens are easy to navigate. Anybody that's got a smartphone out there is used to looking at the icons and selecting what they want. So what we've done is we've gone to a menu base like that. So if I go ahead and hit the pages key here, as you can see, everything shows up as an icon on the screen for me to use. Or if I want to go up to settings, I can arrow up to my settings and I hit the enter button. And this allows me to now navigate through my settings screen and change anything that I need to. So if you combine this unit with the value, the ease of install and the ease of use, this is probably one of the best units you're gonna get on the market. From inland to coastal waters, you've probably heard that BOAT stands for Break Out Another Thousand. And fishing is challenging enough without having to worry about being able to afford a good fish finder, much less learning how to use it. So if you're looking for a budget-friendly fish finder with superior GPS technology and easy to use, then stick around, because today I want to tell you about a fish finder series that's built for you. Let me introduce you to the Garmin Striker Vivid Series. With a bright, sunlight-readable display and intuitive, easy-to-use interface, the Striker Vivid Series is a great choice for inland waters like lakes and ponds where a chart plotter isn't necessary. And let's not forget the inland saltwater boaters and kayakers, who can also take advantage of all the great features packed into these Striker units. Fishing comes in all shapes and sizes. From what you're fishing for to your equipment, you get to choose. And here at Garmin, we want you to have options for your electronics too. Not only do we offer the Striker Vivid series in 4 inch, 5 inch, 7 inch, and 9 inch screen sizes, but select Striker Vivid units come with the proper transducer in the box, which includes mounting hardware for both transom and trolling motor installation, allowing you to have the perfect setup for your fishing adventure. And let's face it, we all want to get the most for our money. So we've designed the Striker Vivid series to come standard with many of the sonar features found in the higher priced units. That's right, these units are built with Chirp Traditional, Chirp Clearview, and Chirp Sideview sonar capabilities based on the model you choose. The Striker Vivid 4CV, 5CV, and 7CV come standard with Chirp Traditional as well as Chirp Clearview capabilities 
for a crystal clear view below your vessel. And stepping up to the Stryker Vivid 7SV or 9SV adds side view capabilities. Not only will you see what's directly below your vessel, but you'll see what lies off to each side, making it even harder for the fish to hide. And speaking of making it harder for the fish to hide, the Stryker Vivid series includes five new color palettes, including Lava, Rusted Steel, Caribbean, Ice Blue, and Aqua. These new Vivid colors make it even easier to distinguish fish and structure, helping you to catch more fish. But we didn't stop there. Some of the advanced sonar features we added to the Stryker Vivid series include the ability to rewind the sonar screen to view recent structure you might have missed, as well as A-Scope. When A-Scope is turned on, a vertical flasher will appear along the right side of the screen. This feature displays the most recent sonar return, which means when you see it in A-Scope, you're directly over the target. And when you land on that feeding frenzy, you should have a way to save and come back to that location another time. So we've designed the Stryker Vivid series as a fully functioning GPS fish finder. Yes, I said GPS. All Stryker Vivid units come standard with a built-in high sensitivity GPS antenna, giving you the ability to mark waypoints, create routes, and view boat speed anywhere you go on the water. So you can not only see fish and structure below the boat, but you can easily mark those favorite spots and navigate back to them. And creating waypoints in the Stryker Vivid has never been easier. It's as simple as pushing the mark button. This will create a waypoint at your present location, making it super easy to mark the boat ramp or that special fishing spot that you found. And creating your quick draw maps is super easy. Just select and turn on quick draw contours from your menu bar. As your vessel moves through the water, the quick draw mapping software will generate real time one foot contours on your screen with help from the returning transducer signal. As long as there's a green circle around your boat, you're reading the bottom and generating one foot contours. If the circle turns yellow or red, you're moving too fast to build the best contours. So you'll need to adjust your speed until the green circle reappears. That's all there is to it. These contours are yours to keep. But if you have the Stryker Vivid 7SV or 9SV, you can even share your contour data through the free Active Captain mobile app. Just turn on the built-in Wi-Fi connectivity on the Stryker Vivid 7SV or 9SV, connect to your mobile device, and now you can share it with the QuickDraw community as well as download cartography shared from your fellow boaters. I don't tell them to stop.